Hello everybody. So recently I've been obsessed with Depop. I know I'm late to the game, but I just recently discovered it and honestly it's like going thrift shopping without actually having to go through a thrift shop. I finally ordered my first thing off of Depop and now we are going to do an unboxing. So first of all, it was actually really easy to buy um, this dress that I bought. So I contacted the seller, her name is Rachel, and she was really nice. Of course, before I bought the actual item, I made sure to check the reviews on her page to see if people had any trouble with the items that she was selling, or if they had trouble with the shipping or something like that, but all of her reviews were really good, so I trusted that my experience would be good too. So here is the package, it's actually covered in hearts and clouds that she drew. Um, I'm gonna try to show this without showing my address or her address. Wait. Wait. Look. I don't know if you can see it. <laughs> Struggles. It's really cute. So I'm pretty excited. This is actually supposed to be um, kind of like a Rachel Green dress from Friends. So yeah, let's see. Let's open it. Here it is. Can you see it? Oh, it has a note! So cute! It says, thank you Monica, I hope you have fun rocking this piece. XOXO Rachel. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. <laughs> Let's try it on. Okay, so this is actually one of the cutest things I've ever owned. I'm serious. And by the way, this isn't sponsored by Depop. I'm genuinely obsessed. It's not good for my wallet. So there you have it. This was my first experience ordering something from Depop and it was a really good ex first experience. Rachel was a really good seller and I'm going to link her Depop account in the description. Now I can go to a coffee shop with my friends and dress like Rachel Green, even though my name is Monica. Whatever. So the dress actually fits perfectly. It fits just right. It looks like it's in a really good condition. It doesn't smell weird or anything. And it's not stained, it's not ripped. It looks brand new to me. Before I bought this, I looked up Depop videos and I saw a lot of people getting scammed and stuff like that. But I still went for it, so I just wanna go, I just wanted to make a video of my experience because it was a really good one. You just have to find good sellers that have a lot of reviews and of course don't spend $500 on something because obviously that's too much money to buy from a stranger on the internet. If I have some tips for Depop first users, read the reviews obviously, have a conversation with the seller beforehand and buy things that don't cost an arm. Buy cheap things. <laughs> It'll be better for your wallet and for your heart. What? So this was all for today. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys later.